What's up folks, my name is Jolan and today I'm showing you my take on smoked pumpkin pie. What's different about this recipe is a delicious graham cracker crust and a very flavorful topping of bourbon and vanilla in the whipped cream. Ingredients in the crust are graham cracker crumbs, cinnamon, warm melted butter, and some granulated sugar. This process is quick, so it's a good time to preheat your grill to 350 degrees. Now, take all those dry ingredients and mix them into a medium-sized bowl. Then dump on the melted butter. Mix it all up really well until you have an even consistency. It should start to feel more like wet sand. Dump it into a 9-inch pie pan and use your hands to press it down evenly and firmly into all the corners. To really settle in the crust, cook it in the grill at 350 degrees for 15 minutes. Then take it out and let it cool while we prepare the filling. Now for the filling, I keep it simple with one 15 ounce can of pumpkin puree, one 14 ounce can of sweetened condensed milk, two large eggs, cinnamon, nutmeg, cloves, and salt. Whisk it all up really good. You want to make sure that you don't have any clumps of spices to ruin that good flavor. Go ahead and pour it right onto that cooled graham cracker crust. Definitely make sure to tap it a few times to get all the air bubbles out. Toss it in your grill and smoke it at 350 degrees for 55 minutes. You'll know when it's perfect when you jiggle it and everything except for the very middle is firm. Now that looks perfect. On to the best part, the whipped cream topping. This whip is made with heavy cream, powdered sugar, a dash of vanilla extract, half a shot of high quality bourbon, or a full shot if you're feeling it. Whisk the heavy cream in a bowl until you get soft peaks forming. Add the powdered sugar, then comes the vanilla, and whisk a little bit more. Once you have firm peaks forming, we need to add the bourbon. But, if you really are wanting to impress your barbecue friends, you can first smoke the bourbon. Take a small handful of pellets and hit them with a torch. Place a mixing glass over the burning pellets to catch all the smoke. Now this next step needs to be quick. Lift up the glass, dump in your shot, and close the glass to shake it up. This trick heavily infuses the bourbon with smoke flavor. Dump that bourbon into the whip and whisk it up just a little bit more. You are now finished with an amazing pumpkin pie. One that contains a unique crust and a very unique top. Go ahead and cut it up. The middle should be firm when you're about to serve it. Top it off with a little bit of whip. And some crushed walnuts. And feel free to dust it with some cinnamon if you're trying to be presentable. And there you have it, a very untraditional way to cook a traditional Thanksgiving pie. I will be back very soon showing you folks more of my favorite festive foods to cook on my smoker. So don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and let me know what you want to see smoked next. See you next time.